we have an update on the sycamore gap tree that got cut down and a man another man has been arrested a 60 year old a man in his 60s has been arrested so it continues medium latte extra hot episode 52 let's dive into this Sexulation is rife at the local pubs. I heard it was a tenant farmer evicted from his land. One drinker at the nearby t nearby Twice Brewery Inn tells me he threatened he would cut down the tree. Oh my gosh, that's insane. Um, another rumour circulating is that it was a National Trust worker who had been sacked in the morning, stole a chainsaw and felling gear in retaliation, a claim denied by the Trust. So there's lots of rumours going around. Let's have a little dive into um, one of the newspapers as well. So on Friday, Northumbria police said they had arrested a man in his 60s in connection with the felling of the tree. And he remained in police custody, assisting officers with inquiries. Detective Chief Inspector Rebecca Fenny Menez, Menzies, I don't know how to pronounce that, of Northumbria police said the senseless destruction of what is undoubtedly a world-renowned landmark and a local treasure has quite rightly resulted in an outpour of shock, horror and anger throughout the northeast and further afield. I hope this second arrest demonstrates just how serious we're taking the situation and our ongoing commitment to find those responsible and bring them to justice. But while investigations are ongoing, thoughts are already turning to how the site could be restored. Just look at that. Look police line there do not cross so horticulturalists have suggested helicoptering in a mature sycamore to take its place that's not a bad idea well anthony gormley the sculptor of the angel of the north is believed to be involved in discussions to create an artwork at the spot no. you don't like the idea no. <laughs> discussions are ongoing uh, about using the wood from the felled tree for a sculptor or perhaps erecting some kind of silhouette of the tree at the spot to recreate the much loved vista. On Friday, Robert McFarlane, the landmark's author and Cambridge professor, called for a sycamore gap forest to act as a memorial to the felled tree. That's not a bad idea, having a, a growing more trees. It was a tree that ashes were scattered under, marriages were made under. It offered shelter for tired walkers. It was a landmark in the region. It was a landmark in the world. It was a friend to many, he told Radio 4's programme. There's been an outpouring of grief for the fallen sycamore. The outmore has been profound with many visitors to the site, moved to tears, perhaps reflecting broader fear of loss of our landscapes. I can't stop thinking about it, Police and Crime Commissioner Kim McGuinness said on Friday. This beautiful tree was iconic. It was as, as iconic as the Angel of the North or the Tyne Bridge. So many of us in the North East feel like kind of grief that our tree has been taken from us forever. Let's have a little look at this clip. Tragic, isn't it? On site, look, right there. Wow. It's so big, such a big tree. It's unbelievable. Crazy. So, what do you think happened? So, you've got a 60 year old man. You've got a 16-year-old boy, both been arrested. Are they connected? Have they done it together? Is it a father and son? Um, is there some kind of uh, grievance with the National Trust? Or is it the farmer? What do you think? Comment below. Um, also, what do you think they should do? Should they fly in a new, a new tree? I kind of like the idea of that, having a new tree that looks similar to fill that space, replant it. It's not as historic, but maybe it could be a tree that has some history um, or maybe some kind of sculpture. What do you think, Penny? What do you reckon? Any ideas? Do you like the tree or do you like... Um, um, or do you like the forest idea? There's a forest idea. Like, um, maybe if they had any tree 
maybe if they had any seeds from the tree and they could plant that seed. That's a really good idea. Well, they could let the original tree just grow, right? Yeah. If that one doesn't grow, then they can get a seed. Yeah. From the original tree. Yeah. Well, maybe they could have a sculpture there. Maybe a sculpture there while the other tree's growing. So you have this really nice sculpture and you have the tree there. And then when the tree establishes itself, they can remove the sculpture. Uh, or maybe a memorial kind of thing. I quite like that idea. Um, so I am not working today, but I am off to the composting site to get rid of all this crap and rubbish in the back of my van. But I will be working tomorrow. So I'm probably going to do a little video tomorrow, Sunday, for the first time. I want you guys to have a lovely day. I want you to appreciate nature 